lesson 8.12 uh, packet 8c and this topic of this uh, lesson was about uh, difference tables of quadratic and the goal was to use difference tables to analyze quadratics and other polynomials so basically what we trying to do was to um, get the equation of function from table that's what we did in this um, analyze the table so that we can find a function so that's that's what we're doing so number six does this table match a quadratic function so so uh, theorem 8.6 says uh, if the second difference is constant then it is a quadratic so we first find the delta which is the first difference what's the difference between the two consecutive one this and this it's two right uh, how about the next one it's eight how about the next one that's twenty you know and then and so on and so forth and the second delta is you look at two uh, these consecutive one and find the difference what's the difference it's six right and then what's the difference between these two that's that's twelve and so on and so forth and the delta second delta is not a constant therefore it is not a function it is a function but it's not a quadratic function sorry Exercise 7 and 8, find a function that agrees with the table. Uh, the first one is easy, find the delta, and the delta will be constant, right? Uh, it goes down 14, and it goes down 14 consistently, so you just plug in B equals uh, delta times A uh, plus 13, that comes from uh, here. You know, output of 13, we did that in second term or in the beginning of first term. Um, so you plug in negative 14 right here and so B equals that times A plus 13 but the next one will be a little uh, trickier so let's find the Delta first it goes up by 8 for the first one if you look at negative 12 and negative 4 and negative 4 to 0 you have to go up 4 and out of that uh, 0 to 0 you gotta go up 0 and 0 to negative 4 you gotta actually go down to negative 4 now let's look at second Delta first delta you go down negative 4 8 to 4 you go down 4 4 to 0 you go down 4 and 0 to f negative 4 you gotta go down negative 4 so it's negative 4 uh, del second delta is constant second difference is constant so this is quadratic so quadratic formula is uh, in, the, in the normal form is uh, a times x squared plus b times x plus c. So the point is, how can we how can we tell what the a is and b is and c is? Uh, c is easy because that's the output of zero, so that's got to be negative twelve. And how can we find a and a and b? So uh, in the textbook on page seven forty nine, actually explains very uh, carefully. So, uh, also theorem 8.6 says the constant is 2a twice the coefficient of the squared term. So, that constant right there, if you divide that into half, that's, gonna, that's, gonna, that's a. So, a has to be negative 2 because that's half of it. And how can we find b? That's the tricky, trickiest one. So, we're going to look at delta, uh, the first difference right there. And we know that first difference is always a plus b and then the second one uh, the first difference of of input one is three times a plus b so we know that a plus b is ten right here not ten I'm sorry it's it's eight oh I can erase that I guess so it's eight that comes from right here Okay, and the next one is 4, so I'm going to put 4 here. And we also know that A is negative 2, we got it from here. So let's replace that, so that's going to be negative 2 plus B equals 8, also 3 times negative 2 plus B equals 4. What is the number? It's 10, so the B has to be 10x. And this is the equation that match match with this table uh, the next one that is kind of I misplaced the table so we don't really know what that is so let's skip that 
problem 11 and 13 use this input output table show that the table does not match a linear quadratic or cubic function so in order to say linear so the first difference has to be consistent in order to say it's quadratic then the second difference has to be uh, constant and if you follow follow the pattern if the third uh, difference is not consistent then it is not a cubic function so extend that this table um, to the and find the first delta first difference second difference and third difference and if nothing is consistent then it is not uh, it either it is not either linear quadratic or cubic problem 12 which of the following rule rules is the closest fit for the table explain so what I recommend you to do is plug in some number in there so for example rule number one y equals 2x uh, minus 5 let me plug in 0 right there so if y is 1 then input is 0 does this make sense no so it doesn't match so how about the next one how about the third one how about the fourth, fourth one make sure you try everything and uh, uh, try multiple numbers to make sure.